LJ Smith of the Greyhound Sports Network standing alongside victorious head coach Jeff Puxen, defeating Gettysburg College in the Centennial Conference opener, the home opener, and family day all here at Rocco Calvo Field. Coach, how does it feel to come out away with a victory? Yeah, they're not easy to come by in college football. So to come out with a victory at home, first home game, first conference game, uh, you know, it was really important to us, there's no doubt. And, uh, you know, all week we talked about being more consistent um, in all three phases. And I think, you know, for most part, we, we had a lot of consistency today. So, you know, to see that, the players are fired up playing in front of their families and their loved ones and friends and everything. So it was, it was great to see. Uh, persevered through a tough third quarter, I thought, you know, defensively. Um, you know, weren't, weren't very consistent there, but the offense really had our backs and ran the ball really well, generated some first downs, stayed ahead of the sticks. And, uh, you know, to come away with a win against a, a very good Gettysburg team um, is great today. You get out early on Gettysburg, the first half with a with a big lead, things clicking on the offensive end. Uh, t tell me a little bit about who really stepped up in these roles today. Yeah, I think, you know, credit to the staff for doing a great job during the week of putting our players in positions for success, and then the players having the confidence. So, you know, I thought right off the bat, number one for us, Jordan Lewis, um, you know, really did a really good job on the perimeter, catching the ball, winning some balls, um, you know, doing things like that, which was great, um, you know, really to see. I thought Jared played really well today. I thought he extended the ball, extended plays, um, you, know, on, uh, you know, on some downs there with his feet, um, but kept his eyes downfield. So he's able to generate some positive yardage without having to run the ball there. And, you know, Nate Boyle and Angela Macera, I mean, geez, what, what a great combination today. Um, and I think really fed off each other. So was really, really proud of, you know, the way our offense responded. And then other guys stepped up, too. I thought the old line um, really played with some good confidence today, which was great to see after week one. Um, you know, big strides there with those guys. Really proud of those guys for communicating and playing really well today. So it, it was great to see our offense, um, you know, really coming out, starting fast and finishing strong. You alluded to a shaky third quarter, but defense uh, gathering things, collecting themselves, uh, key contributors on that side. Yeah, I think there's probably a lot, you know, probably played eight defensive linemen today. So we rotated in there. I thought Jack Golick played really well today. Um, you know, I thought Javier uh, Espinal Katz, you know, moving from an end and moving inside, did some really good things, um, you know, without a doubt. So I think, you know, a bunch of the D-line, but those guys stick out. Nick Levinsky's very, very active in the second level, um, you know, and then I thought in the secondary, I thought we played pretty well. We kept the ball in front of us and did some good things. You know, third down, you know, third quarter had a couple breakdowns here and there, stuff to clean up, you know, figure out how we coach it better. Um, you know, tomorrow, but overall really proud of our guys and you know, a lot of guys, you know, were able to play today. It was great to see. One of only four home games this year about to hit the road for the next couple of weeks. Tell me a little bit about what the guys were like pregame because it's they're taking Rocco Calvo Field for the first time for some of them and in, in front of this great crowd in Moravian University. Yeah, absolutely. You know, I mean, heck, you know, we got new jerseys, new home jerseys. They were excited about that. You know, they were excited about walking down to the field house together after breakfast, you know, and having the, the band there and the cheerleaders there. So the environment was great for the first home game today. And, you know, I thought the guys really grew up from week one to week two so I was really really proud of you know their mentality how they responded mentally I thought they played really well physically um, there's no doubt about that but you know just you know credit to our guys for persevering and doing a great job and making that jump from week one to week two Jeff Puxen the head football coach here at Moravian University earning a victory on family day on Rocco Cavo Field thanks for your time coach thanks LJ